so I tried to make this card battle game with actual creature species, but for some reason figuring out how fast the cards go by googling it is really difficult with water creatures for some reason. Okay, so I searched the speed of a Wobbegong, right? Wobbegong sharks are known for their lightning fast, right? Okay, I mean, that's not too bad. I can just google speed of lightning, right? How fast is lightning? 270 million miles per hour! <laughs> There's 270 hundred thousand. 270! 2700,000! This is hard to say, I think. What? <laughs> just, just pretend I said that right. <laughs> okay, so, uh, it's fine. I'll just have this random creature just have the speed of 270,000 miles per hour. Did I say, did I say that right? <laughs> yeah, look. <laughs> it's gonna have the highest speed out of all of the creatures in this game, even the ones that are gone dear. That's fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, it's, it's fine. It's an off red card game just for fun. I will tolerate this. But no, this is. It got even more difficult. Bluegill speed. Okay. The maximum of blah 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 of a bluegill sunfish is 2.4 liters a second. Okay, measuring speed and volume is a little weird, but maybe it turns into actual terms if I convert it. But no, it's it's still cubic. Like, how do you move in cubic? Like, what do you... You don't go by, cu like, the cubic volume of air that you travel by when you drive a car. You just go by miles. You don't go, cubic air miles of dribbling your job. Nope, you, you just say miles. So what does it mean when it's, like, cubed? It's cubed. It's cubed! What does literally... 